Hello, YTPC. Ethan, Parsimonious Piper here. Today we've got a Parsimonious Pipe and some shout outs. Let's take a look at that Parsimonious Pipe. Today we have a three star Pipe by Lee bull cap. Let's take a little closer look. As you can see, this has a very rugged style of rustication on it. This type of rustication was made popular by custom built back in the 30s to mid 40s. Tracy Mincer, to be exact, his era at custom built. Let's take a look at one of his pipes. You can see the obvious similarity here. This pipe came first. The Tracy Mincer era at custom built ended in 1946, whereas this pipe, as we will see, uh, this uh, pipe by Lee has the three five pointed brass stars inlaid which puts it somewhere uh in the mid 50s uh early 50s mid 50s to uh, early mid 60s so around a decade after the last tracy mincer pipe was made now let's go back and take a look at that yeah up close now you can see the obvious imitation on this pipe if imitation is the most sincere form of flattery, then Pipe by Lee is flattering the snot out of custom built with this pipe. Rotate that a little bit so you can see a little more of the carving around the, the rim of the bowl and those stars. The undercarriage has the same type of uh, rugged rustication carving on it. Makes for a very nice feel, texture in hand. Pipe does not slip in the slightest. Lastly, just a little bit of a peek down the stem and shaft. Overall, a lovely pipe. Paid a little more than I usually do for a pipe by Lee, just under $60, but I have not seen any other bull caps uh, anywhere that were in the kind of condition this one was in. I, I just had to do a sanitation on it and smoke it. So somebody else had already put in the elbow grease to make this one pretty. And with that big wide bowl, um, it, it, it's a fantastic smoker. I, I love these thick walls. Um, the, uh, the, like I said, the, the imitation of the custom built was obvious. If, you, uh, if you're a fan of custom built, there were an awful lot of imitators Pipe by Lee was one of them. Let's jump into shout outs, shall we? This week I have four. It's funny. Um, I, I'm, I'm stuck right around 725 subscribers. It, it seems that uh, every week I pick up a few and then uh, Monday I piss somebody off. <laughs> well, so be it. Let's take a look at the four brave new souls that have joined me since the last time I did shout outs. Non presenters first, as always. Weather Piper, thank you for the support of my channel. Papa Shrink P Piper, thank you for coming along. Now I've got two guys who are not newbies. And who you definitely should check out and whose uh, channels will be linked down below as always. Pure Pipers. These guys are entertaining. Informative. And uh, they've got a few videos up right now. Just under 500 subs. They're definitely worth a look. The other one is the is a revival of a channel that we hadn't seen from in a number of years. And that is Nathan Campbell. Welcome back. Thank you for subbing my channel. Uh, Nathan, you should definitely check out. Um, he His old content is good. And uh, he's got a, just a handful of videos uh, since he's come back. And I, I think you're going to like it too. He's got a bunch of subs. And deservedly so. Well, folks, let's show these guys a little support. 
while you do, light something you like. Enjoy your afternoon.